mention it all. Mention it all. Goodbye, Kyle. Who's calling who a frog? Love you, baby. Bye. Hello, Burberry Troop. Welcome back. I'm the real Andy of Burberry Hills, and welcome to another piece of tea of the day. Today, I'm bringing you tea from my hotel in Mykonos because it is too hot out there, and I am not a sun kind of guy, okay? I'm like a little vampire. I love the night, so when it's like too hot and too sunny, it's a no-go for me, okay? So anyways, girl, girl, we need to talk about Vanderpump Rules. But before we get into it, do not forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Do it right now. If you are new here and you want to get the very troop, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Hit the notification bell, guys. We are on our way to 30K. So if you want to join the family, you know what to do. And let's talk about these friends. Friends? Mess. Oh, my God. <laughs> Anyways, girl, Vanderpump Rolls. It is official. We have season 10 of Vanderpump Rules coming. Yes, yes, yes. I'm so excited. I love, I love Vanderpump Rules. You know that I live for Vanderpump Rules. I'm like, I am so freaking excited, okay? I knew it was going to happen. I know it was coming. You know, I it, it took them long enough, and I'm, I'm guessing they're going to start filming like ASAP, you know? Uh, probably in the next couple of weeks or something because they usually film uh, when Pride is happening. You know, and Pride in West Hollywood is going to be on June 3rd. So I am guessing it's going to be like like this, you know, like, okay, we have green light, do it. Just go for it, okay? Now, extremely early to know what is going to be uh, about... Um, casting or changes you know um okay let's see what do we know james and raquel are over okay raquel i honestly felt like andy gave her a goodbye at the reunion you know it was so like so what's next for you raquel oh so you're gonna become a nurse mm, it was so nice meeting you please block her unfollow unsubscribe you know like it, it felt so much like that i don't know i mean i know raquel has been working overtime you know uh trying to be on the show i mean she, she was dating peter madrigal uh there were rumors that she was going out with tom schwartz but that never actually you know came to fruition so i think she wants to stay now is she going to be asked back that's what we don't know because I feel like James Kennedy has has more weight than Raquel, and I don't know if he is gonna want her to be around. But who knows? James at the same time is dating this new girl, but that right there could be an interesting um, storyline as well, right? Well, Tom Schwartz and Katie Maloney, girl, I'm telling you, that's going to be the big, big, big storyline you know like that's going to be what's gonna shock these people and it's going to be interesting to see how they're going to react to see if they're gonna be taking sides to see if um i mean what is going to happen you know and it's gonna shock absolutely anyone everyone you know um tom sandoval and ariana honestly i have not been seeing much from them uh, I think he was doing, like, tour with his um, group, but that's pretty much it. You know, I haven't really seen what they are, are they into. Now, um, well, Sheena and Brooks, I mean, they're definitely going to be coming back. I think they're going to, yeah, just continue their relationship. I think they are on such a better space this time around that last year. Um, last we know, we heard, uh, Brooks already paid all his, uh, child support and he was, uh, doing all the due diligence to actually see his kids again. So I think that part right there, it's also going to be interesting to see because last season he, he didn't get quite of like a first shot 
but it was also so many red flags that what else could we do you know like that's what we that's what we are literally seeing on our tvs you know so what are we else supposed to believe but i know that he's in, in a way better shape this time around so i think it's going to it's going to be definitely different right from last year so i'm excited about that uh lala i mean i don't know if lala is going to be returning guys okay she has been hinting many many times that she doesn't know if vanderpump rules is the right space for her um uh, now you know, she feels that she grow up, she feels that she's a mom now, and she feels that she basically doesn't have the time to be going around um, screaming and getting into, like, stupid fights, you know? Plus, I'm guessing she's also going to get on a um, custody battle over uh, with Randall over Ocean, so I don't know, I don't think she's going to want to be, you know, exposed as a bad mom just for a reality show. So it's going to be interesting to see if Lala decides to continue or not, okay? Also, we know that Lala is feuding with Tom Schwartz because Tom Schwartz hang out with Randall the other day. So she's definitely not... Uh, sorry, guys. She's definitely not messing with that. And... I mean... I don't know. I don't know if she actually will come back. And, you know, I mean, Charlie, the pasta girl, no idea. Like, honestly, no idea if she's going to return or not. I actually would like her to come back. I actually like her a little bit more last season than her first season. Like, her first season, I was like, I hate this bitch. Take her out of my TV. I can't stand her, you know. But last season, I was like, mm, you know what? I can, I can have a little bit of respect for you. So I, I definitely will want her to be back for another season just to see her develop, you know. It's nice. Sometimes we, we don't we don't give people a chance, you know. But it's nice to sometimes see people like over the years and see how much they change. So, yeah, I wouldn't mind her to be back. Uh, but I do want my diversity that it was promised on Vanderpump Rules. Where is my gay character? Where is my black or Latina or brown or Asian, whatever, um, staff member? You know, like I will, I definitely will want to see some diversity into Vanderpump Rules because we definitely haven't seen anything. And it was promised last season. And I think their diversity was showing uh, the black guy who is the manager of, of Tom Tom, which he little they literally use him to put him on the the credit scene, you know, on the promo scene or whatever. And then he was on the show like one time for literally like half of a second. That's not diversity, baby girl. Okay? Like we I we need I want a gay character. And I don't want a stereotypical gay. I don't want, you know, a sassy, oh my god, yes queen. No. I want a regular gay guy, you know, who I can identify myself and being like, yes, you know, creating drama and getting into fights with these bitches. Um, I want that, okay? I am visualizing that. I'm putting it out there on the universe, you know? Um, and I think, yeah, I think that's pretty much it. I'm very excited. Season 10 is coming. Um, well, Katie actually was, uh, on Stasi's wedding. Yep. And someone, I think actually it was my husband. <laughs> uh, he uh, sent me a picture with someone filming. So maybe we're going to see some filming of Katie at Stasi's wedding. Maybe it's possible. Can you imagine a return of Stasi Schroeder to Vanderpump Rules? Girl, I will be dead. I will be dead. That's all that I need to give me a perfect show. Okay, guys. So, that's it. That's what we know so far. Um, let me know what you think in the comments below. Are you excited for Vanderpump Rules? What do, you, what do you want to happen for next season? Let me know. And like always, don't forget to like this video. Share this video. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. 
and I'll see you around. See ya. Bye.